I'll be showing the all-new AI-infused Microsoft Paint, and this is part of the latest Windows 11 update. The new Paint has co-creator with Dolly, background removal, layers, and more. So let's get started. The first new feature is background removal. So I've got a nice picture here of the Windows XP original desktop, and I'm gonna paste a picture of Darth Vader. I'm gonna drag Darth Vader down here on the nice field, and I wanna remove all the background around him. Up here, there's a new button, and it says Remove Background. And if I just click this, just within a second, it removes the background using a little splattering of AI processing. And now Darth Vader is nicely put onto the green field. The second new feature is dark mode support in Microsoft Paint. So in the upper right, I will click settings and there is some different themes you can choose. I'm gonna choose dark mode. Ooh, that's really nice. Got a little Darth Vader vibe going on here. And the third new feature is co-creator with Dolly infused AI in Paint and we're gonna do some co-creation with AI and Darth Vader. So I will go on to co-creator right here, and it says describe what you'd like to create. And this is just like some of the generative AI you've probably seen like Dolly. What I'll do here is have a picture of Darth Vader in a nice green meadow. And you can choose a style. So I will choose a selection here. I can do oil painting, watercolor, digital art. I'm gonna do an oil painting of our good friend Darth Vader. Now at the bottom, you can click create right here. And note, there's a little set of tokens. I'll click create. It's gonna go and start thinking about this and it's gonna generate me a nice picture. It's gonna explore some variants, so I'll get a few different options. Oh, there we go, look at this one. Darth Vader, little oil painting and a nice grassy field. Oh, that one, he looks a little more mean in that one, a little tougher Darth Vader. And here's one, he's sort of got that looking off in the distance view for Darth Vader. So a couple of options. I think I like this one best, the mean Darth Vader. I'm just gonna go up and crop it. And now my beautiful co-created image in Microsoft Paint is ready to save and share. Co-creator in Microsoft Paint is in preview like you see here. It's also powered by Dolly. So right here, it's powered by Dolly. And the nice thing about Dolly is it's always getting better. Dolly 3 just came out recently, and you can expect more improvements here in the future. The fourth new feature is layers in Microsoft Paint. Historically, layers is more of a fancy feature in places like Photoshop. Now, layers is in Microsoft Paint. Over here on the right, you're gonna see this layers option, and I'm gonna click this. Here is a nice image of the old school Windows XP desktop background. Now, I wanna add some layers onto this picture so I can work with it better. First, I'm gonna grab a nice image of Clippy. I've got my image of Clippy, and over on the right, I will click plus to add a new layer. And here is that new layer. What I'm gonna do is do paste, and it adds Clippy over here on the right to the layered image, and it's on the image now. I can drag this over. We're gonna move Clippy right here. Now I wanna add another layer, and I will click plus. Now I'm gonna go grab a modern Copilot logo, because some people say Copilot is the modern Clippy. So let's go get that. I've got my Copilot image, and I'll do control V to paste. There's my Copilot image and I'm gonna drag that onto my Windows XP desktop background. Over on the right, you're gonna see these three different layers and I can hide and show each one. If I wanna hide Windows XP desktop, I'm just gonna click this, the little eye, and I've hidden it. I can hide Clippy, now I just have this logo and if I wanna work and do paint and text and images or whatever I want, I can work on that layer. I can easily show these as I go like this. You can also arrange the order of the layers. So if I wanna have the Copilot logo be on the bottom layer here underneath Clippy, I can just drag drop. You can also right click and say move up and down. You can easily delete a layer. You can duplicate a layer and then you can also merge down. So let's say I'm getting ready. My photo is finished here. I've added whatever touches I want. I'll select Clippy. Right click and say merge down and it merges Clippy into the Copilot layer. So if I just wanna have those two on a layer, now I can do that. And if I wanna merge the whole thing, I can merge it down just like that. And when you're all done, you can just save this just like you've done in the past. And if I undo, it'll pop me right back to where I was before. If you wanna keep up with all the latest Microsoft updates and tips and tricks, subscribe to my channel and then just ring the bell so you get all the latest videos that I post.